Hi guys and welcome back. So today we are opening my goodie box together. So goodie box is a beauty subscription service that is available in the Netherlands. From what I'm aware of, it's actually one of the first. I've been wanting one for ages, but none of them deliver here. This is actually my second goodie box. So I got my first one in May and absolutely loved it. So I thought I would share it with you guys. It comes like this to your door. So uh, let's have a look what we got this month. So the box has come like this. Last month it was exactly the same, but it was kind of orange on the front. And I definitely like this color better. So as always, you get a little leaflet explaining what the products are, what they're for, how much they would cost normally. Um, and every box from what I'm gathering is themed. So last month was Instagram theme. This one is a summer bucket list theme. So I'm not gonna have a look in here yet and we'll have a look in there together when we go through the products. So all the products come in tissue paper with a little goodie box sticker. It looks really, really, really like cute always. Okay, first thing. And um, typically it's gonna be something that I'm gonna butcher the name of. Um, let me see. Comédieu, maybe? Maybe, it's a face mask and it says hashtag blue paint. So maybe it's a bright blue face mask, that would be pretty cool. Um, and it says it's pore refining and mattifying. Uh, let's see, this would normally be 17 euros in the Netherlands and this is a full size product. Let's see what it looks like inside. So the inside of the box is actually really cool as well, it's all like blue splattered paint. And it comes in a kind of toothpaste tube, if you will. If you wanna know if this is blue, come and follow me on face mask, because guaranteed if it is bright blue, face mask, come and follow me on Instagram, because guaranteed if it's bright blue, it's gonna be on Instagram, or me and Jelly are gonna have it on in Insta stories, or something. Next up, this box looks pretty cool, so let's go for this one. This is the Tees Cosmetics Desert Metals Mascara. I have had, I've tried a few Tees products before, um, but only their lipsticks, if I remember rightly, which I really like. So this is in Midnight Sky, which makes me think it's black. So it's a little bit weird that it's Desert Metals. Oh yeah, it's definitely a black mascara. I was kind of expecting it to be a colored mascara, maybe. But this one is volumizing, according to the package, and this would be 22 euros if you bought it in store. And again, it's a full size product. Um, the lipsticks, like I said, the lipsticks I had were really quite nice. So hopefully the mascara is well, well, is good as well. Lordy, I'm having a hard time talking. Long lasting, water based, paraben free. All sounds pretty good to me. Looks like we have a lipstick. So this is from Masauda Milano. I had never heard of it before. And it is this crazy bright pink. I have just had my teeth done, so maybe I will be able to wear this off without looking like Beetlejuice, but we'll see. Again, if this works, it'll be on Instagram because it is an amazing color. It smells, it doesn't have a strong smell. I cannot stand lipsticks with strong smells. It doesn't have a strong smell. It smells almost like vanilla-y, but really, really, really subtle. Um, yeah, I've never heard of this brand before. I've got to say the packaging is a little, not cheap, but kind of like drugstore packaging, I guess. This would be, 13 euros normally and I guess so I've got a pink one by the look of the pictures some people will have got red and some people will have got pink next up we have a blusher I'm guessing yeah blush it's an argan oil blush from Pays Cosmetics I guess you'd say I'll put it I'll put the name on the screen just to be sure um, but this is it's actually a really pretty kind of corally colour um, with a little bit of gold shimmer in it by the looks of it. I'm normally a matte blusher fan more, um, but the gold might just be, it looks like the gold could be a spray over. I'm not 100% sure. 
on first testing, just like this, it actually seems a bit patchy, um, but it is actually a really nice colour. I'm not, however, a big fan of the gold sparkles, so, but I'm going to try. Sometimes things look way different on your face than they do swatched on your hand, especially something like a blusher. This is normally 10 euro in store. And again, another full size product and from a brand that I've never even heard of, which is what I really like about these beauty subscription boxes. You can try so many things that you would never normally be able to try or get your hands on or spend a fortune on being able to actually try them. So the last thing we have is a hand mask. I've never actually tried a hand mask before. I do have one in the cupboard, I think, but I've never actually tried one. Um, so this is, a, again, a really shitty name to try and pronounce. Mikura, I'm going to say, from Copenhagen. Um, hand mask, special two-layer hand mask gloves for normal and dry hands. So this would normally be €7.50 in store. But it says, wash your hands thoroughly, place a hand mask on each hand, tighten the hand mask at the wrist. I like that, that then, if you've got... I've got like tiny skinny wrists and hands so that you can tighten that, that's really cool. Um, so there's, it says tighten the hand mask at the wrist using the adhesive part, so remove after 15 to 20 minutes, no need to rinse. I might try that tonight. I'm definitely the most excited to try these, so the face mask and the hand mask. If you want to know more, for sure I'll be putting them on Instagram if they are any good or not. But that is it for today. Um, let me tell you a little bit more if you are interested in Goodie Box. I will leave their um, website and their Instagram in the description box. This is now going to sound like I'm sponsored, but I wish. Um, it is $19.95 a month, and that's including packaging and everything, and you get the box delivered to your door every single month. There is no extra charge for shipping or postage or anything like that. You're not tied in, so you can cancel it at any time. Um, and then you create, an, you create an account online, so you have your login profile. Um, and on there you can enter, I think they call it your beauty profile. So you can enter in kind of uh, what skin tone you have, what hair colour you have, uh, eye colour, all those kind of things. So then if there are products that are shade range, like foundations I guess, or particular hair products maybe for what condition of hair you have, that they can make sure that the right colour or the right thing gets in your box, which I think is really cool. Um, and you can also build up points. So they have a system on there where you can review each product. And every time you review, you get 10 points. And you also, I think you get 30 points when you sign up. Um, and then once you've got, I think it's 338 points. It's a really random number, if I remember rightly. Then you get a free box, so I think that's really cool. You also get your own little link that you can use with friends, so I can't put it in the description box. But you can send it to friends and they get 50% off their first box and you get 169 points. So then you're well on your way to getting a free box. And who doesn't love a freebie? Um, and I have to say, I've had some contact with them. They have a like chat function, um, so you can ask them questions. And Everything I've had to ask them and everything, they've been so friendly and so helpful and really quick to respond. So all in all, in general, I'm absolutely in love with the company and in love with Goodie Box so far. I cannot wait to tuck into the goodies of this box and then see what comes next month. Um, but that's it. If you have any questions, then pop them in the description box below. Description box, comments, you know what I mean. Um, and if you have any video requests, let me know down below. Follow me on Instagram, I've mentioned my Instagram a bunch, I love Instagram, I also have a Facebook page, they are all, as always, in the description box. I should probably stop talking, because I really have nothing else to say and I'm going to ramble a bunch of crap. I don't know if you can see him, Jelly's over there, in bed, feeling like crap. There you go. Bye, bye Jelly! Bye. <laughs> um, but that's it, I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye!